So let's take a look at how each one is applied. Here are the three different triple desk algorithm versions. So in order to understand our table, let's look at some definitions. E stands for the encryption algorithm. So when we apply E, we're actually doing the encryption. D stands for the decryption algorithm. Our keys are represented by K1, K2, and K3. Now remember that triple DES is the original DES algorithm applied three times. It doesn't make a lot of sense to apply an algorithm three times with the same key, so we need three different keys for each iteration of the application. And then P is just our regular old plain text. Okay, so knowing all this, let's take a look at the chart. Now, the first version of triple DES has an effective key length of 168 bits because it uses three separate keys. The second two, or the second and third versions, each have an effective key length of 112 bits. So the first one has a, effectively a longer key, but again, the strength is equivalent among all three versions. So what happens is, we go to the inside out. You remember, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally from math class, which stands for parentheses, then exponents, and so on and so forth. That's the order of operations. The idea is we start inside our parentheses first. So we take the third key, and we encrypt our plain text. The output of that encrypted plain text with key 3 is then encrypted with key 2. And the output of the new encrypted ciphertext is applied to the third encryption pass with key 1. And that is the output of the triple DES algorithm version 1. The second version only uses two keys. And what he does is he substitutes key 1 for key 3. So effectively, he will take the plain text, encrypt with key 1, take that output, encrypt with key 2, and then take that output and encrypt back with key 1 again. And the last version is just a different, slight different version in that he decrypts in between. So he'll encrypt with key 1, and then he uses key 2 to do a decryption, ending up with not plain text, but actually ciphertext. And then he takes that output and he encrypts it again with key 1. Those are the three different ways that the triple DES algorithm works. And your choice just depends on the number of keys and the length that you can allow your keys to grow to.